Hello art fans, the Windsor Artist is back and I'm doing a double flip cup this morning and I'm excited because it's going to be ocean, greens, blues, you know, an ocean theme and I always loved the ocean so um, I had a hard time getting it to flip but uh, as you can see that there's still some paint in the cups so, <clears throat> so without further ado get down to this so I am using primary blue uh, cyan titanium white manganese blue thaleo uh, and turquoise green mixed with a little bit of cyan <clears throat> oh and then a deep green mixed with a little bit of black to just to give it a little bit of flair uh, these have Floetrol, silicone, water, and pouring medium, and I will probably do, be doing a little bit of um, torching today as well. I may make more white so I can get some more white contrast in there. So let's pull them up. So like that. So I will be back as soon as I am done tilting the canvas and causing this to spread out. Hello art fans, Windsor Artist back and just look. I've got cells, um, I got marbling, uh, a little bit of crazing. I think I should have put a little bit more uh, pouring medium. Um, I still can't get my paint thin enough, but um, it still came out really nice. The only thing that I, I blame myself on is I didn't make enough paint. And, um, but just wow, look at that. It's just, it's gorgeous. Really, really nice stuff going on in here. Beautiful. Now this was a double flip cup, but it did not have enough paint. So I did a third one on it, and I kind of just, I did a flip cup, pulled it up, and then I filled in with whatever left, you know, paint I had left. So, good news is I didn't waste any paint. Bad news is it took longer to do because I didn't have enough paint. But all in all, I think it's beautiful. I really do. So I call this one a happy accident just because I didn't have enough paint. I think if I had more paint, it would have been more to what I was looking for, you know, more of a, an ocean underwater. But it still has that oceany underwater feel. Just not as I don't know um, not what I was exactly looking for let's just go with that but still came out really really cool looking uh, the only part I don't care for is this area right here just because I think it should have a little bit more white in there so I might go after I'm done filming put a little bit of white in there just a tad bit you know kind of mix it up just because I feel like it's been isolated and I want it to kind of mix well. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this, this look. It's really, really nice. And I will do a photo update on my uh, Facebook page at the Windsor Artist. So stay tuned. Hello art fans, I am back and I just wanted to give you a little bit of a update preview of what's going on um i did a little bit of torching after i shut off the camera and i want to just show you what happened when i did that i got a little this a lot of cell work right in here and right in here 
I also went in through with my palette knife and I kind of did a little bit of like um, path making, pathfinding, I guess you could call it. Um, just, I don't know, I wanted to incorporate the colors kind of like a stream or water flowing. And I like the way it came out with that. You know, the kind of this area right here that was isolated that I didn't like. It kind of brought it all together by doing that. And I really, really like that. So, um, again, not what I was going for, but what came out, I am extremely happy with. Love it. Uh, this is an 18 by 18, so the person that buys this, I hope they really, really love it as much as I do. Um, I will see you next time.